Hello my beautiful people and welcome to episode 7 of my Love & Local series with me, Thais Meets Tressa. Have you ever wanted a product with all the hassle of having to order it online? Not to mention having to wait the 2-3 to three weeks before it's actually in your hand? I'm about to show you some of our hidden gems right here in Trinidad and today. Community businesses that offer amazing products at such affordable prices. No ordering in advance, no credit card, no Skybox, no customs, no problem. Welcome to Love and Local. I come to you all fresh face, moisturized, because I'm sure you can tell on this camera I look a little greasy. Moisturized and glowing because today's video is all about skincare. <laughs> And I know I said that this season was going to be about beauty and beauty related, which includes skincare. This is the first skincare brand I'm including in the Love and Local series. So I hope you all enjoy it as much as I do and I did because I would have been using any products for the last few weeks. I would like to say two to three weeks. So yeah, without further ado, I'm going to introduce you all to NYX Mix Naturals. Now, forgive me. Like I said, I've been using the products for the last few weeks. This is not how the bag came. <laughs> the bag was in pristine condition when I picked it up. Um, I ordered it, like, I think I'd like to say, like, um, let, let's just go with a Monday. And I got it, like, by the end of the week. It did take a week because she made all the products for me. So, right? Um, my bill came up to $150. Um, I got a $10 discount because she was not pleased with the containers that she gave to me. She told me that they were the last set that she had and they were a little rusted on the covers and she felt a little bad so she gave me a $10 discount. I paid $140 for all of the items that I am about to show you now. I bought four things, right? And her packaging is the cutest, right? So I bought a soap. This is what the soap came in. Um, this is the Arabica Coffee Soap Bar. I hope I'm saying it properly. Uh, Arabica or Arabica. This soap bar. And I thought I, it's $45 for the soaps. So I thought I was going to bring out one big block of a soap. Um, I didn't know it was going to be this big one. I thought it would have been a little smaller. But it's huge. And I ended up getting two, I'm guessing, because of the size of it. But this is one of them, and I've been using the other one, and oh yeah, I have it here for y'all. This is it out of the packaging, right? And it's two, I got two of them. So I've been using that on my face. When I tell you, I don't have problematic skin. I've never had problematic skin, but when I tell you, I usually get at least like one or two breakouts, and I've had none. I've had none since I started using this soap. Now, I always moisturize. That's something that I never miss even prior to buying her stuff. I always moisturize. That's like my thing. So I would always wash my face and I would always moisturize. That, that was my only routine. I never had a set skincare routine. That was the only thing that I stuck to. So when I got this, I was very, very happy to have something that I would use to wash my face. Other than that, I would random face washes, soap. I did not have a set regime. I used to, and then, I don't know, I just fell off the wagon and then I realized, oh, my skin is not problematic. I don't really need to set myself up for something. So I just stopped spending my money. The only thing I used to spend my money on was moisturizer. So I was really glad to get the soap to include it into my routine. So now I actually have a face soap. This is a face and body soap, but I dedicated this to my face because I bought another body product. And I really wanted to give you all like the full rundown. I wanted to use it exclusively. So I've been using this now for the last, <laughs> I've been using this now for the last two to three weeks. Absolutely love it. And I got a card that tells you how to use it. And it tells you its ingredients and everything. Packaging. Top tier. Moving on to item number two. So I also bought the natural makeup remover. She has a tag and everything. So I bought the natural makeup remover. Because you all know I'm a heavy makeup girl. 
so i needed a makeup remover i usually use wipes i have a video dedicated to this so stay tuned for that right so this is the all natural makeup remover and everything when i tell you everything smells amazing it smells so good item number three it looks a mess now it really does because i've been using them this is the charcoal teeth whitening toothpaste now what i'll say about this i've tried it without my regular fluoride toothpaste and i've tried it with my fluoride toothpaste um the taste not the best the taste is not the best the look of it also not the best so it really is your preference i prefer to use my fluoride toothpaste first because this is all natural there is no fluoride in it i prefer to use my fluoride toothpaste and then go in with this as the last the last thing to finish my teeth routine okay and lastly i would like to say save the best to last because i 10 out of 10 recommend this this is the lemon turmeric body scrub and it came with a spoon let me find it oh, come on it came with a spatula a big spatula so it's like a wooden spoon and you get to scoop it out and when i tell you this smells so good oh my god it tastes it let me taste <laughs> it smells like juice it smells like juice so it makes you want to drink it but please don't it it smells i keep trying to say taste it smells so good and it has me glue wing in case you didn't notice and i i am just i've never been into like you know the holistic care and all of that oh found my spoon found my spoon this is the spatula that it came with so i like like the big brands i like the avinos and the neutrogenas and all of these the CeraVe's and the La Roche Posay, I love all of them. I like the name of it all. I've never tried like natural remedies for much things except medicine. So you know, because you know we, we all know about the bush medicine, right? So I've never tried any of those. So this was my first time actually trying like you know homemade um stuff, and I am one hundred percent sold on it. I love my experience my first time experience i absolutely loved it it's all natural skincare products and you know she gives you cards with each product and i love that because it tells you what exactly is in it and what you're putting on your skin and it gives you directions for use now i've been using the body scrub for um, I, I try to use it every other day. I did not always stick to that routine. Sometimes I probably used it twice for the week. Um, <laughs> so it didn't really work out. Sometimes I use it once for the week. I think in total, I probably used the scrub like in the last three weeks. I probably used it maybe about five to six times. And you can see how much I still have in it. Um, the only thing that I did not like about the scrub is that it the, um, the directions say that you should wash with your regular soaps and everything and then apply the scrub and just rinse off with warm water, right? Because it is oil-based, um, when you leave it on your skin, I know a lot of people don't like it, there, there is a residue and I don't have a problem with the residue. The only problem that I ran into is I like white. I have a lot of white clothing, so I wore a white t-shirt after I used it the first time and areas where the t-shirt would be rubbing so like in my armpit area um around my neck area it got a little yellow because at the end of the day it is turmeric so that's the only thing um the stain on the clothes but the stain did come off when i washed it um so yeah i didn't have to do like any extensive stain removal processes or anything like that so other than that that's the only thing i would say with the scrub but i love the scrub i love it um the thickness of it, maybe I wish it would have been a, the, the, the grains itself um, because there is brown sugar in it. The grains itself, I wish was a little smaller, but it's sugar. We, we, what are we going to do? I did enjoy this scrub so much. It smells amazing. It leaves your skin feeling nice and moisturized and supple. And, you know, you just feel so good, right? I'm going to insert a video with me feeling myself. <laughs> Run the clip.
So y'all, that is the introduction of this week's business in the spotlight. It is Nix Mix Naturals. Be sure to check out her page. I bought the lemon turmeric body scrub. I also bought their charcoal teeth whitening toothpaste. And I bought their natural makeup remover because y'all know makeup girl first. And I bought the coffee soap. This is the Arabica coffee soap. And I am 100% pleased with the products and the service, right? And they are not expensive. And I will be showing y'all results of everything. I'll be very candid with y'all in this upcoming week with how I use the products and everything. Trust me, support local. Um, this is the first time I've actually done natural and I was, I was a very, 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 very 110%. Please. So, I hope y'all enjoy this video and I'll see y'all in this week for the rest of Love and Local episode 7.